What's going on, people? I'm in my garage. Welcome to Nola Outdoors, fishing and outdoors. I went to Academy the other day, right? And I wanted to give me a 4,000 series reel. So, that's what I did. I went and got the Pen Pursuit 4. Hopefully I got the Roman numeral right. It's the 4, and it's a, uh, they say 6,000, but it's the big one. It can hold a, um, probably about 400 yards of um, braid. Four to 600 yards. Let me see. Oh. Oh, braid, braid, braid. Yeah, 30 pound test, 490. 40 pound test, 390, 50 pound, 335. Yeah, it can hold a lot. Gear ratio, 5.6 to 1. Um, carbon fiber drag, uh, four seal stainless ball bearings. That's what I look at a lot of times. But this is um, this is what I went and got. I'm along with some bullets, but we ain't talking about bullets right now. But this is what I went to get. And so um, I went and got a Daiwa uh, pole, 12 foot pole. It's a, a surf pole, so that's what I'm gonna get. Um. That's what I went got. And of course, that's some of my gear right here. Right there. I'm in my garage. Some of my ugly sticks. That's for like speckle trout fishing and you know stuff like that. Um bass fishing. That's my ugly stick. That's my little giddy up everything right here. I gotta go back in and redo some stuff. Let me see. Overview everything. I'm uh, been fishing for a long time, but uh, since I've gotten older, got some of my stuff in, so I still have to go and add more stuff. But I have a, a, a plastic in here, swim baits, of course, perfect powder bait. These do well with speckle trout. I do all right with these. These do real well. Sport baits. Um, worms. More worms. Uh, those are Mr. Twisters. Uh, worms. You know, you go to Walmart, you get them on sale for like a dollar. You know, that's towards the end of the year. That's the best time to get them. Sometimes you can get them into the month. This is a good one. I used to catch bass with these. This color when I was, when I was uh, a teenager. Yeah. Yep. Zoom. Yep. Shad. A lot of plastics. Another Mr. Twister. Now, Bass and Assassin. Saltwater Assassin. This is definitely good for speckle trout. Put it on a one eighth, uh, one eighth uh, jig head. Man, that thing is a winner. Pop it under a cork. And we down in Louisiana. Pop it under a cork. And man, you can do real well. This is about as good as a Deadly Belly. Deadly Belly is another bait that a guy named De Dudley Vanderborn made here in Louisiana. This is good. But his was a little bit better. Of course, the trusty sparkle beetle with the red spot. One eight jig head, pop it under the cork, or you can swim it and jerk it. Of course, steel leaders. Ah, oh, they're coming out. Gotta fix it. Gotta fix it. So, I hope you got the white grub, curly tail grubs. You can catch just about anything with these fresh out salt water. Real good, real good. Here's another one. Green with the uh, uh, orange birds and tail. Cockahoe minnows. They do all right. And these are for perch crappie and stuff like that. This was 10 cents. Good deal. This one, 
No RGs. Got those for cheap. These for cheap, so. Yeah, and on the side, I gotta give me some more coins. Got to this dude and I'm holding my phone, so. <laughs> Hopefully this comes out right. I don't have to do this again. And uh, over here, got my scale. So, and all my multi tools and stuff like that. Some weights. And some stuff to hold, put stuff inside of here. And here. And on the back. Right back here. Got this for Christmas. Um, and it was like $30. That's yeah, all my rattle traps and stuff like that. And get some more though. That's weights. Um, hooks. I'm going to get some more hooks. And that's a, those are some more rattle traps and plastic. So it's just a. Um, and here's some more plastics back here. And stuff like that. Plastics. Um, I can get those Berkeley Swim Bait Power Baits. And this is Catfish Bait. Which I think I'm going to leave that out of the bag. That's Gulp. You know what I mean? So you take and throw that on the thing. Catfish Smelt. Take these. Leave that out. But yeah, that goes in on. Uh, I have these sit back here. I don't know why. These things are really good for speckle trying to bass and stuff like that. See that holes on 18 times longer? That is sometimes not true. <laughs> I had footage of fish spitting them out. And I'm going to see if I can find that footage and post it. They were spitting this hook out. I mean, it was ridiculous. How many times they were spitting that thing out, man? They spit out a rattle trap, and a rattle trap has two... Uh, two uh, uh, trouble hooks on them and they were spitting them out and the speckle trout was bigger than that one I posted on my short so um yeah they uh they get the job done but um they're pretty good but uh for right now that's pretty much it I got some other things I'm gonna start posting since I just started my channel so yeah, I'm just sitting in the garage. This is the my Malibu. This is the one that gets me around where I'm going. So when I'm going fishing, push the seat down, throw everything in the back, and I get going. It's your boy Brown. Welcome to my channel. Love y'all. Peace. Fishing for life.